hello everyone and welcome back to my channel welcome to yet another day of tra me trying 31 new eyeshadow palettes today we're gonna do a very quick look and i'm gonna use the color pop so fly eyeshadow palette if you watched my video from earlier this day i believe it's uploaded because it took some time to upload um, you'll see that I unboxed it in a mystery box. If you haven't watched that video yet, please, if you like videos like that, go and watch that one too. It's a bonus video. And now I'm going to do the other side of this eye priming. I really want to see if I can get this look done in like under five minutes. Well, without the priming session and me rambling on, but like the whole actual makeup doing portion. Okay. I think that's about right. I see my lashes are stuck together a bit. Which I don't know why. I don't know why that is. Okay. Let's get into it. My eyelids are primed. My hair is kind of weird today. Like that. Yeah. Okay. Let's get some eyeshadow brushes out. Okay. I'm going to start with the shade Dragon Tail. Just gonna throw that on the eyes. It's a nice neutrally shade with like a mauvey undertone, I feel like. A mauvey peachy undertone. It's different. I like it. Just blending that in. It looks a lot more gray in a pen, but that's also probably because of the background colors and the colors of the other shades, which it will look more muted with, but like, as you can see, it is a little bit peachy and warm and not as cool toned as I personally expected. Then let's go into the shade Colorful, which is this peachy shade. We've done like a beachy look like three days in a row now, haven't we? Because we did the Root Cosmetics and the LA Girl one. So I hope you're not getting boring of me doing peachy looks. It's not very me to do peachy looks, but maybe it's the new thing for me. I know one thing still isn't really my thing and it hasn't been for like years. And it's um, a, um, what was I going to say? It's a warm tone look. Okay, I'm now putting the darker shade called Dems, what? Dames Fly. I don't know if that is what uh, it says. Dames Fly? I'm just going to put that on the lid and then blend it into the crease a bit to give it a little bit more depth. That seems okay. Just blend, blend, blend. Okay, I think we blended it out nicely. Now I'm going to go back into Dragon Tail and just blend over that a bit. Oh my god, my battery is running out. This is so stressful! Okay, I think, I think the base is done. What I'm going to do now is put on a little bit of glitter glue. I'm going to take you through what I used in a second. Do you see me feeling stressed? Because I am. I am feeling stressed. Just because, you know, 
my battery is running out and everything. And I'm gonna use the shade FYI, which is a duochrome. Okay, that looks really gorgeous. Stunning shade. Okay, I put that all over the lid, and now what I think I want to do is put the shade's slight path in the inner corner, just lap it like that. And then I'm going to take the shade Skydive, which is just a little bit lighter, and I'm going to put that right there in the transition-y part. So from flight path to the um, FYI shade. Okay, okay, okay. Do we have to do anything else about this look? Let me see. No, I think we're fine. I think this is what we're going to do for today. So, quick roundup of this palette. It blended out very easily. I mean, I got my eyeshadow done in like almost under five minutes. The um, duochrome, or what is, it? what is it? Shifty shade is gorgeous. It like shifts green into like a peachy nude um the matte shades blend very beautifully and very like effortlessly easily obviously the shimmers do too i never really had a problem with color pop shimmers ever in my life um and i just think this palette is very cute very actually kind of unexpected i think this is not a lot a thing a lot of people would pick up and i didn't either but now that I have it, I think I, I could definitely see myself reaching for this and reaching for that like shifty shade more often than um, what I would expect when I got the palette. So I think this is a pleasant surprise. I think it's a really good palette. I think if you like a good uh, shifty shade and if you like a little bit of peaches and like in a neutral way, definitely like this palette and so if you if you'd ask me if i'd recommend it definitely if you like this color story i would definitely recommend it quick walkthrough i used this then this then this for the crease so like this this and this like this right bro and then i used this little triangle on the eyes on the lid so that was a very quick one, but thanks for watching and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and hit the notification bell and I'll see you tomorrow.